Our top story tonight, a missing mother of three believed to be in danger. On Sunday, 31-year-old Cindy Gosselin walked out the door with just the clothes on her back and her family hasn't seen her since. As our Alicia Neaves explains, the last time anyone heard from Cindy was in a phone call that same night. Alicia? And that phone call came through Facebook Messenger. Cindy didn't take her cell with her. She used someone else's phone to make the call. The problem is the family doesn't know whose. It's weird because her daughter said she was laughing and smiling as she was walking out the door. In a black dress and high top sneakers. But then she just doesn't come home. Cindy Goslin, nicknamed Shorty, left without telling anyone where she was going. She told her daughter, you know, that she'll be back either late in a couple of hours or by the morning. Her brother James says all of her personal items are still in her apartment. No matter what, she always kept in contact with a friend, a family friend, or one of the family. No matter what, any time she was out and about, there was somebody who always knew something. Cindy lives at the 707 Lofts on the east side off of 410 near East Houston. Her family handed out flyers there today. The more eyes and ears out there in the community, the closer we might be able to get to something. Cindy is unemployed. Loved ones say she lost her job after being hit by a truck in July. Police say she has a medical condition. She's classified as an endangered missing person, but police couldn't share why. She didn't even have a car. She left walking. She left on foot. Cindy's daughter was the last to hear from her. Around 930, the night she went missing, a call came in via Facebook Messenger. She said she needed to talk to her. Something was going on, but she loved her daughter and she was scared. And then the call disconnected and nobody's heard from her since. Cindy is four foot 11 with hazel eyes and red curly hair. She has several tattoos, including a clown on her hand, a Virgo symbol on her wrist and SpongeBob on her arm. Cindy's three children are staying with family and friends for now. If you have any information on this case, if you know where Cindy is tonight, call San Antonio Police Department's Missing Persons Unit at 210-207-7660. We're live at Public Safety Headquarters, Alicia Neaves, Ken's 5.